it is uh, up to their government so you should put pressure or you should talk to the Myanmar government not to Bangladesh it is not the Bangladesh people's responsibility right these are people in a desperate humanitarian situation and surely there are basic principles human principles moral principles that compel you to help them Bangladesh is already an overpopulated country we cannot bear this burden you should realize that but now things are okay things are improving so no refugees coming but in the last two months we, we've seen the pictures ourselves Bangladeshi guards physically turning people back returning no, them to danger listen listen uh, Bangladeshi guards they behave humanitarianly they provided food for them medicine for them they provided money and they just allow them to return to their own home not allow they force them to no, return no it is home. not true they, they didn't force them rather they pursue them that you should go back to your own country and they went back prime minister you know full well that they are being persecuted in their own country they tried to run away and they refused entry to your country well why we should allow to enter our country we just pursued them and we pro provided them all everything what they needed why are you asking me this question you should ask this question to the Myanmar government it is not our responsibility it is their responsibility and have you ever expressed concern to the government of Myanmar about how the Rohingya are treated in Rakhine province of course we do and what do they say well they, they are creating a uh, congenial atmosphere they are providing all the assistance everything do you actually uh, believe that yes why not? So you think the Rohingya are treated fairly in Rakhine province? I told you that it is their citizen, so it, it is up to them.